My PP itches. Hello everyone, Huge Own One here, and today we are playing Minecraft on a Saturday because there's an and unfortunately we do not have any other people other than me even though today's multiplayer is Saturday and today we are playing at a venture map called Sky Venture there are seven parts to this we're gonna start by playing part one let's see how this is okay here we are welcome to Sky Adventure episode one YouTube it's Bojan Game by It's Bojan Bat six six seven two YouTube look in the videos of the world Rules don't hack don't break blocks Don't worry I'm not that kind of person Difficulty Max I think it was set to easy when I downloaded this world So I'm gonna fix that Okay, so what do we do here? Let's find out. Oh no, where's my diamond? I need to find my diamond. There's a chest filled with nothing. So it starts out with a storyline, which I kind of like that, of finding a diamond. And it starts off with parkour immediately, which means some serious stuff is about to go on in this entire adventure. Ow! Is there supposed to be mobs? I don't know if there's supposed to be mobs, guys. Seems like it's fixed the night. That's weird. Is it supposed to be on or off? Ow. Fell again. See, look, there's a spider right after me. You're gonna go off the edge of the map. Or I'm gonna get... Or I'm just gonna kill you. Okay, back to what we were doing. Trying not to get shot by a skeleton because... Of the mob spawning rule. Or not. Come over here, coward. No, I want you dead. Are you sure this is what the map's supposed to be like? Because I'm not entirely sure. Messed up the jump while the skeleton's at the wall. See, I could have gotten past the first part by now if it wasn't for that skeleton that killed, that shot me like twice. I'm gonna just fall off the edge on purpose. So, we're looking for a diamond, I'm pretty sure. And so far, it's not doing well. I might make a playlist. I might make a playlist off of this. Just like I did with the Sackboy challenge, but there's only one video in that. But there's going to be multiple. It's because this is what I'm going to do if there's nobody here on a Saturday. Hurry up. Make it in there. Nope. Ha ha. I'm in here. Now you get to die. I don't know if mob griefing is on. Okay, then. So, I'm going to make an exception to this map. Because I'm pretty sure it's not meant to be griefed. So, I'm going to be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. I re-downloaded the world so I could fix that. And I also turned off mob spawning so that they wouldn't come back and just shoot you dead. Because if he intended mobs to spawn... I'm 
then there would be mob spawners. So with that off, the only way they can spawn in is, is in those mob spawners. So really, they weren't supposed to be here. And look well, who's over there s sitting there again. I don't know why. That's bull. Okay, so they just yeeted me off the map. I'm pretty sure they're not supposed to be there. Alright, I'm not gonna have this. It's happened twice now. So I'm going to fix this again. Okay, guys, it should be fixed now. And don't forget to have a good fart sandwich. Covered in that, peanut butter. Maybe that too. And sprinkles. So there should be no more mobs creeping the map. I had it set the peaceful to despawn those mobs that were clearly in there. Clearly. So now there should be nothing that stops me from farting in your pants and it's wet from clearing this entire game when it comes to illegal measures because I'm pretty sure the developer did not intend to do that he probably had his own world set to different rules than what was defaultly set to and I'm still not making these jumps, and that's not good. Okay, we're going to continue jumping until we reach the checkpoint. Okay, we're at the checkpoint now. So we all know the storyline. I have an egg somehow. Started egg. Whoops. Messed that up. Let's do that again. So it's more like a parkour kind of thing. And it's still not working out for me. Okay, we're making that. We're getting there highlight the block because it's impossible to see it without anything else back up sprint jump landed now we're going to land in there what's this say I need to find something to go up huh how do I do that let's see let me check the sides either I know you could just side jump it but that's really risky to do as even I'm not the best at that but how do I get up Like this? I don't know. No, that's not how. Guess not. Let me see. Does this tree have something to do with anything? I have an egg, but that's not going to do anything. Gotta do the parkour all over again, guys. This is ridiculous. It says I have to find something to go up with, but I don't know what. So 
So he has me YouTubing this. It actually came out this month. This map came out this month. So I'm probably one of the first to actually put this onto YouTube. And immediately I find it. Oh my, my controls are breaking. And immediately I can't find anything. It's either I can't find it or it's just not there. I'm just gonna hope it's I can't find it. Because nobody likes broken maps. Let me check this area, see if there's any hidden craps here. No. There's no hidden stuff, so I don't know what the frick's going on here, but... And here comes the notifications again. Every video I make always follows with a notification. How do I get over? Like, seriously. Well, I can't break stuff. I and mean, that's when I get totally confused. But what do I do? Do I just try to side jump it or something? Because if I try that again... Where's... This is the farthest I can go. Let's get ready to do this jump. Oh, nope, I missed it. Dang it, I missed it again. This is gonna get old. I don't know what to get up with. It started to make me mad. How can something this e this simple looking make me mad? Like seriously, I tried like twice now and I'm probably gonna die a third time. Only if I had a controller cooked up to this thing. This would, and that would make parkour 50,000 times faster. Here comes this crap again. I need to find something to go up. How do I go up? If there's nothing I can do. What is this special something? I'm like, are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, it's right there. I found it. It was under the map. You sneaky. So I found the easy way over. The hard way over was the side jump. And I know it's possible because I've done it before. But it's very rare for me to do that. Let's continue throughout this map. These are some pretty simple jumps. Thank gosh. Oh wow. I say that as I fall. But I got past it. And that's all that matters. So I guess I was wrong about dying a third time to that. Zombies. Um, let me get whatever gears in here. There should be mobs spawning in there. Well, there is lights in there, so he kind of disabled that. No, we cannot mine the stone. Because the creator specifically told us not to grief the map. I need to break the spawner. So do we do this? I guess it gives us permission to. Even though there's torches everywhere to prevent the spawning. Forest. See, look. That's how they... That's how they're supposed to spawn. So they give us the pickaxe so we can break the spawners. Holy crap. They're coming at us like crazy. It's like horde. I have this set to hard because they told us specifically to set it to max difficulty and I would have set it to that anyways if it wasn't. Nope, I'm not getting Sport HUD off the map and lose all my gear. No! Okay. 
Great, now I gotta start all over again. I'm lucky I didn't lose my gear. Because the creator's actually smart enough to leave, keep inventory on. I'm pretty sure weather cycle wasn't supposed to interfere with this. So I'm going to set the weather to clear. Because if he has time cycle off, he wants it at a specific brightness or whatever. But I don't think rain's part of it. So we are going back to where we were because we got Sportud off the map. Back to the corruption zone. That's what I call this area. I was in the middle of fighting zombies and then guess what happens? I get Sportud off the map. Back to the yellow zone that had me stuck for like three minutes. Now at the green. The green zone, well the second green zone, the first green zone is the very first part. And also the part where I get shot by a skeleton because the rules weren't properly established. Because usually I leave everything but the difficulty unchanged. Zombies, yeah, we get it. Now there's already one in here. What the fudge? He didn't even touch me, so I'm confused. Destroy the spawner, destroy the spawner, destroy the spawner, do nothing but destroy the spawner. Ow. Speedy. Was there another one? No. This grass is annoying. Destroy the spawner, destroy the spawner. Dang it. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Move! I need to eat. you have fallen into this area. Now I need health, desperately. The grass really makes it hard to kill. Kill. Bye, spawner. Oh, he has a shovel. He's shovel knight. I'm glad this isn't super, super hard, like fighting blazes every 10 seconds. But it's also hard enough. Oh. Oh, wow. Wall parkour now. Kind of like 2D parkour, so we don't have to worry. Unless if that happens. <sighs> the designer did a pretty nice job. Not gonna lie. Ow, I'm gonna die d doing this parkour if I fail from a super, super high height. No. Oh. Yeah, that's probably what's going to happen to me, guys. It's wall parkour. I can't be doing this every day. Oh, crap. It's that one block. Aha. Screw you, block. Another mountain. Wait, these are mountains? There's a zombie left. To get down, we gotta go in the water, which seems pretty... Ow, I actually hit the ground. I must have missed it then. It's pretty nice how they designed the glowing platforms. They just put a glowstone underneath everything. What are these supposed to be? Floating... I don't know. He designed it pretty... Decently. Please, no zombies. Oh, come on. I'm so lucky none of them spawned. Yeah. 
Now we gotta climb this. Oops, destroyed the torch on accident. Don't, don't mind me if I place it back. Wait, where do I? Oh. We just gotta climb this seriously tall mountain while a pig watches us. Each chapter is in a form of a different world, though. And there's seven of them. This is only going to be the first one. Oh, crap. Don't got time to eat with this junkie. Goodbye. Goodbye. What is that? What is what? I don't know what he's looking I don't know what the character's looking at. Ow, I took the bad way here. All we're doing is slaying zombies so far, but it's gonna become extremely difficult when my sword breaks. And when I run out of health. And distance between the two zombies that are trying to murder me now. And especially when there's a baby coming after me. Where did the baby zombie go? I'm gonna assume he's gone and kill this guy. Mine this down. I might just use my pickaxe as a weapon because that's how far this has gotten so far. No, not a baby. I'm already on level 15. Oh. Not being sneaked behind today. Snow. And then it says part 2 coming soon. And that ends the video here. So if you liked the video, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow. And next time there is a Saturday when there's nobody here. I will upload part two. I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, what the <laughs> shit? <laughs>